after a Gorgon. Um, most good Gorgons, what they'll do is they'll swing around a corner, they'll hit you with Web Snare so you can't get off the ground, and then hit you with Acid and throw a Spider either behind you or in the general direction of the, the support or Medic. So always just be very, very careful about those little small Spiders. That's how they're always going to win. In this case, if they go around a corner, just like have a ping him through the yep. walls. Because he can't channel while he's getting hit by it. Okay, so first thing, he went backwards behind here, which is That's interesting, but when you travel, you're going to leave trap marks, so there's kind of like no reason to do this, unless he's going to try just to do a stage one fight. This is a very, this is a very unusual, yeah. Yep, spider. Uh, just to him, by the way, if it's on you, you can just hover over it. What do so, you say? I don't, I don't, yeah, I, if the, the spider trap is after you and you can't kill it before it reaches you, you can That's really it. risky. That's really risky. I, I don't, like, they, the, the hunter should have, like, if they didn't see any like, traps, should have immediately looked around because there's no way people are going to start guys, off sneaking. Yeah. And the sound alone should give them away. Again, a trap. Okay, so focusing the medic. So Assault is doing no damage while Cabot is, yeah. So, yeah. So I'm Assault so assault needed to do a bit more damage. Um, Trapper. What is Trapper? Trapper's Griffin. Uh, Griffin wasn't... Uh, no, don't, don't, don't ever. Uh, never pick up people in the middle of a combat. The monster's always just going to get free damage on everybody that way. Okay, there's the spider. Spider's dead. If you're being focused by as Lennox, the Lance is actually not that great. Uh, Zug should have popped his shield way, way earlier. Um, as Assault, you don't want to wait until you're low health to pop it anymore. You always want to pop it when it's about 75% health. So now they can go ahead and recover. The monster's already not going to take hardly any damage. Cabot should keep on pinking, plinking back here. Don't, don't go around the corner. Like, there's, yeah, okay. Yep, and then just, because Cabot especially should never, ever, ever, like, need to go after the monster. Because he can shoot through walls. Good healing by Joe. Uh, Joe doing a good job. Uh, Dead needs to start coming towards him. And yeah, Griffin, need, yeah, always run away from Griffin if you're being focused by the monster. Uh, and the monster took a tiny bit of pitch shift damage. Look like he's still, nope, now he's leaving. Um, so yeah, so I don't really like the way that Insomniable started that. Like that's super risky. Against a good team, he would have just gotten absolutely smashed there. <clears throat> Uh, the reason why you should wait to pop your shield is because it absorbs 75% of damage, but you still take 25. So if you pop it at 30 or 40% health, you're, you, there's a good chance you, the monster will just straight up end up killing you. Um, and so you want to pop it earlier instead of later now, is because the whole mechanic changed. What's that trap? Cabot a little aggressive by being in the monster's face. Good, good. Everyone's all grouped up. Yeah. If you're, if everyone's being focused, you always want to stay away from them, because otherwise the monster will just get three hits on it. Don't and watch. Yeah, line of sight. Heal, heals. Wrong heals. Yeah. Don't throw the dome. Don't throw the dome. Nice, nice shield. Nice heal. Dead doing a really good job. Um, remember, always try and run away from Griffin, and then the monster got another strike and is going to leave. Um, Cabot really did not need to be that close to the monster. Just went around the corner and got punished. Now you've got time to play WordPress to your for Monster Hunter. I really suggest the default ones. The default ones, if you don't have a specific playstyle, are really, really good. Uh, smell, climb, and feeding are really good for all monsters. Jetpack is really good for all uh, all characters, especially support and medic. So this monster is mostly just capitalizing on the the hunters being out of position. Okay, now they should set, step back. Don't chase! Don't chase! Don't chase! Don't chase! Oh my gosh! Th this is why you never chase a gorgon around a corner. Don't wait, 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 wait. It's even worse is he and now this person is going to die because the team is not in a good position. 
Like, never chase a monster around a corner, even more so if you are... Huh? Up? Hold on one second. Hi. Hey, Rendy, I haven't seen you in forever! How, how have you been? Uh, perks do staff, yes. What was that? A, a what? I don't have M&Ms. These are Skittles, Aiden. Do you want a Skittle? It's not chocolate. It's different. Don't go on good. Mm. I'm coming to this distance. But yeah, the, the big thing is, is that these, the hunters, you never want to chase a monster. Uh, even more so because if the spider grabs somebody when they go first, and the spider goes behind the monster, that person will never be able to survive. But yeah, especially Gorgon, you never, ever, ever, ever want to go around a corner, unless you're possibly the assault, or you have a really good position around it. But remember, the time is not on the hunters, it's on the monster. Like, impatience will kill hunter teams more than anything else. You might have burned down the building. Well, we do understand... Aiden, stop stealing candy. You have to ask for it next time. You need to ask, okay? Do you want some more? Okay, say, may I please have another Skittle? Yes. Yeah, red and green. Okay, and again, don't throw the dome now. You're at half health and you're fighting the sloth. There's no reason to dome the monster right now. Oh, they're all split up. Yeah, they just need to be very, very careful. <clears throat> hey, Apple Crow, how's it going? Uh, it's three times jetpack isn't really OP, but it does make jetpack management a lot better. But it's not going to make you uh, instantly awesome if you're not very good with jetpack management. I hear it drop, Josh. I feel that you use a little too much sneaking insomnial when you don't need to. Yeah. Yeah, didn't wait, went. Yeah, jetpack recharge is really good. So if you know the monsters in the caves, having two people guard these two exits and two people over here. It means you can collapse if there's a dome, and it makes it so he can't leave the caves. And again, time is on the hunter's side, so they can literally just starve the monster and wait him out. But now he's going to slip by because nobody's nobody's over here guarding these two entrances. Like, you can have a hunter here, and it can guard three actual entrances. A nice spider location. Remember, if, you, if you're if you sure the monster's in the cave, don't chase. Especially, especially Gorgon. That's a really awkward spot for the spider to be. Still searching. Is that the uh, spider? Is he going to come past there? Yeah, what color is he? Because there's tracks leading that? all the way out. Shut okay, the as soon as you hear that screech, automatically start focusing away. And Assault should have popped the shield as soon as it got spidered. Yep. No, don't dome! To medic, never, never, never dome when somebody's that low of health. Even if it's the Assault. The Assault's just going to die now. The monster's going to have one minute to, to worry about. And the pressure is just completely back on there. Everybody should leave the cave. Everyone leave the cave. Leave the cave. Leave the cave. Don't fight in the cave. Don't pump up. Everyone should have left the cave a while ago. A buggy. A buggy, yeah. Everyone should fight out there where you're not grouped up automatically and the monster has to come and get you. And so right now, so, yeah, Zug's going to die, so might as well just do as much damage. Uh, the monster might close it out here. Uh, it's just whether or not dead can hang out for a minute. I don't... Eh, probably not likely. But see, like, the monster's got four minutes run. time. Doesn't even have stage three yet. Isn't ready for Evolve. Uh, I, I, I really feel that, uh, yeah, they should not have gone in that cave. <laughs> Is Aiden the one who ate my M&Ms? Because I lost my m ms I think it was him. It probably was. Aiden gets into a lot of shiz these days. Nice dodging by dead. Uh, just be very careful. The spider is what's going to get you more than anything else. Um, or the web snare. Oh, here comes the spider. Oh, and there we go. That's game. I couldn't move. What? Spider web. No, I couldn't move at all. Yeah, spider web. I couldn't even jump. No, spider web doesn't do that anymore. That was removed. 
<laughs> Apparently didn't. No, because I moved fine other times. GG. Okay, uh, Insomniel, that was a really awkward start because if they if they pinged the beginning, you would have been screwed or if they look for tracks. So if you land and you don't see any tracks, automatically just split up in four directions because that means the monster is most likely going to be close by or he's not very far, so you can afford to be split up a little bit. Uh, second of all, you guys chased him around corners so often, um, and that's what really killed you, because all of you would get hit, and then he'd be able to focus somebody, or someone would get in a spider, because if you are the first person around a corner, and you get caught by a spider... Hold on, my son's being noisy, one second. What, well, that's a pen. Okay, hold on a second. Time to feed the monster. <laughs> yeah, pretty much, he, he's wanting my Skittles. The true monster. Okay. Um, so I'll explain this here, and then we'll get back into it. Um, but yeah, so like the first person around the corner, especially against a Gorgon, yeah, we're, go we're going to play again. No, again. Here, put that in your mouth. Shut up. Okay. So um, if you're ever the first person around, especially against Gorgon, and you get spidered, if the spider happens to decide to go behind the monster and go further away from your team, that person is just straight up dead. You're all you're never going to win that way, and that's why you should never chase a Gorgon around. Remember, the time is on you. The end of by the end of the match, he wasn't even ready for stage three evolve, and he only had four minutes left to work, so the pressure would have been on him. Uh, when you had the dome uh, by the cave entrance. Uh, like, if you know he's in the caves, you can have two people kind of park and just cover the entrances and just dome him when he comes out. Again, time is on your side, not him. Uh, and then when you did throw the dome, everyone went into the cave, which was a horrible idea. And the assault, uh, the, the, sh the personal shield works way different now. Always pop it when you take about 10-20% damage. Even more so, if you're in a spider, I would just pop that instantly. and and well, we did screw up. But, but that's what the point of this course is. It's all about learning. Remember, um, patience really rewards hunters. And in this this version of the game, much more so than the other one, um, uh, monsters punish people being out of position. My, my son's telling me to be quiet. <laughs> what? Another Skittle? Do you like them? Yeah. There you go. Okay. 